Hi guys and girls. Um, I hope you're having a nice week and this English weather is so temperamental and it can do have, play havoc with your skin. So I thought I'd share some of the products that I'm using at the moment. I have a four month old baby and last night I didn't really get any sleep. So today, I don't tend to take baths, but today I thought I really need a bath. I feel really quite tired. Um, so the first product I used today was a Mama Baby Bliss Ooh Relaxing Bath Soak. And that was very nice, chilled, and it's got um, aloe vera, calendula, lavender, and geranium. So very relaxing. <coughs> I know I should really be using products to wake me up today, but some days you just gotta go with the flow when you've got a baby. And then the next product I used after my bath was Seascape Unwind Body Lotion. And that also did the trick. I feel quite mellow now, even though I've not slept. Um, while I was in the bath, I actually for the first time used, well, I started with Rodeol um, Glamtox Cleansing Balm, which is fab. And then I just lay in the bath, had a bit of a soak this morning, using a Dragon's Blood Hyaluronic Mask from Roselle as well. And considering I've had no sleep, and when I say no sleep, I mean <laughs> no sleep, um, my skin's feeling pretty good now. Um, after I got out of the bath, the first product on my skin that I used was the Rodale Glam Talks Eye, because I do try to um, stick with the same range of products for at least a month. I don't really like mixing products when I'm trying different products, so stuck that under my eyes and I mean I think it's all right. Obviously at the moment breastfeeding I can't have any Botox, which is driving me mad because I do love my Botox. Um, so to be honest, in relation to normal, yeah, underneath is quite plump, under my eyes is quite plump which is all good. Um, followed on from the eye cream with their Dragon's Blood Extra Extra Blush Advanced Sculpting Serum. Oh my God, I love this stuff. It's like you put it on and you feel like, mm. <laughs> which again, when you're in your thirties and you want your skin to look good, but you can't have things like Botox, loving that. It's a triple potency Dragon's Blood Serum to sculpt, define and redensify skin appearance with biomimetic, if I can pronounce that with no sleep, TGF, Retino Algae and Hemp, Hematite, mm, interesting stuff. And then I followed that with, again, their Dragon's Blood Sculpting Gel, which is great for plumping. It's a plumping formula to volumize skin appearance with Collagenier and Vulafiline. Can you see that? And I love the packaging. Oh my God, look at this. I don't want to waste my, but this is the moisturizer. And you just squeeze it like that, and the moisturizer comes out the top, can you see? Cool. So no getting it all in your nails, which drives me mental when I'm putting on um, moisturiser, especially if it's a decent one, you feel like you're losing it if you get it into your nails. Um, and again, yeah, I'm loving the packaging. How cool is all that? So after that, um, and after I'd obviously moisturised my body, I always love to use a fake tan. And I use a fake tan pretty much every day, not all over. And I think fake tan applied properly can look great so make sure your skin is all exfoliated and everything I always use a mitt um, and today I used I do use quite a few different skin uh, sorry tanning products but today I used fake bake gold spa professional which is self tan on my face just a little bit on my face after I've moisturized and on my legs because I've still got a bit of holiday color across my arms and chest and stuff so I don't and I don't think it looks I think it looks quite natural um, and it's not too heavy which I love I don't like heavy orange tans this is a lovely color it's great right so after my fake tan application I then used Rodel skin tint well this is basically like a tinted moisturizer um, this is medium coverage and you're, it feels like a second skin which Again, I always recommend in the summertime when the weather is warmer, okay, it's not warmer, but it's still a bit muggy at the moment. I don't really like heavy foundations at all. I like to use a tinted moisturizer. Less is more in the summertime, I think. Um, my old favorite, I have to use it all the time. Every day I use this on my lips. 
Elizabeth Arden A Hour Cream. Just keeps my lips nicely moisturised, so that is, I love that. Um, with my makeup today, I mean, it is very natural, obviously. Um, I used my Contour Cosmetics palette and there. Um, love this because obviously the different colour tones you can mix them up so if you've been away on holiday and you're darker than you usually are it doesn't matter because you've got the darker tones there to mix up um, and then you can also use a lighter tone so I used the lighter colour today oh sorry this one here around my forehead under my eyes around my chin um, and then I used the darker colour so that one in the middle there. Around my brow line, coming in here and down the sides here, it's a little tip that I was taught by my good friend, Joe Coletta, who's a makeup artist, and around here. And then I just blended it, blended it all in. Um, so it looks really natural and it's not like that OTT contouring look. It's just a very, I think it's quite a natural one. Well, hopefully. That's what I think. Um, I've used Rodale's Mascara. Can you see that? Glamour Lash Mascara Skinny. I can't read things backwards, especially when I'm tired. And, um, yep, yeah, that's nice. Obviously, brows are important. So I filled my brows in today with Billion Dollar Brows Powder and Brush. I always start, I start by, by shaping here, so I know I'm starting, I get my line up to my point, here, here, and again, I'm not a makeup artist, this is just my um, daily tips and beauty routine. Um, and then I fill it in down the side here, down the end. Um, what did I use after that? Oh, this is really nice. The, I've got this pink, as you can see, it's quite a pinky pink. Oh, I did use my MAC, um, gosh, the number is, oh, I think it's Spice Lip Liner. I use my MAC Spice Lip Liner. I've used it so much that the all the writing's worn off. Um, I use Glam Stick, as you can see. Mm. <laughs> and um, I also got this while I was away. And I'm quite digging this. Victoria's Secret Very Voluminous Lip Plumper. Actually, I'll put a little bit on now. And just over the top of my lipstick. Goes on really easily. And it does. Definitely. I think that's good for my lips. Mm, a plumper effect. Um, and then I just finished off with a little bit of the Instagram Magic Pen. In the corners of my eyes to try and waken myself up so I don't look as tired. I think I've already said the lash. Yeah. Mascara, and I just finished with a little bit of the Rodale Smoky Eye Pen. There you go. So, oh, with my hair, well, I just used seven seconds conditioner and left it. I can't be bothered blow drying it today. I don't, I don't need to blow dry it today. So I've just left it to dry naturally. And of course, I have my mm -hmm, gold class hair extensions, which I love. Let me just that. Yeah. So. They're so easy to style and everything. It just makes life so much easier with hair extensions. I've got them in at the moment just for thickness. Um, they're the exactly the same length as my hair. So this is my actual hair length. Ooh, ooh, it's grown since I've known Inanch um, because she's been really strict with me and not, not let me damage my hair. And my hair's in the best condition it's ever been. So if you're thinking of hair extensions, it doesn't just have to be for length girls, you can actually have it for volume as well. And um, as you can see, I don't think these are just, I, I love my hair extensions because they just look so natural. But then obviously it's really important that you use the right 
hairstylist and brands and I use Gold Class Hair Extensions um, from a friend in Ant, who's an amazing hairdresser and hair extensionist. So, uh, so yeah, that's my very casual look today um, and my skincare products that I'm using. So, hope you enjoyed that. If you liked my blog, my blog, my blog, um, I know I've rabbited on a bit today, that is because I am obviously not had any sleep. Um, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys, have a good day, girls. <laughs>